Hello and welcome back to another episode of Wasteland 3. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing the Supreme Jerk difficulty playthrough, blind playthrough I shall add. It is episode 35, only two death uh, so far and I think uh, we are on a good run. Uh, we have made our way up to Aspen because we're following the main storyline the psychopath and that's exactly what we're going to do right now we're right up here i explored a little bit of the terrain now that we do have radiation shield uh, three which is cool we'll do something down here and up here as well but uh, we still have plenty of time for now let's check out aspen and get going Woodson, are you re uh, related to General Wade Woodson? Yes, he's my brother. So, you are with the Desert Rangers? We are. Okay, listen up. I don't have much time here. Lock my guards in the can. Nick Buchanan, the Patriarch's crazy ass son, is holding me and my team captive. He's making me listen to radio frequencies for trouble. He doesn't know I've been watching Ranger frequencies too. He needs to come get us. Be careful. How did you survive uh, the attack at the lake? <laughs> we got lucky. I guess. The attack broke up the ice, forced us onto the shore. Hmm. We couldn't help. We couldn't retreat. The only thing we could do was drive back towards Aspen. I hope they had a working radio. Hmm. That sounds suspect. That part worked out at least. Are you injured? Hell yeah. Badly. Don't worry about it. We don't have much time here. Copy that. What kind of threats are we looking up? It's, it's bad up here. Worse than you can imagine. Well, that was concrete uh, info. Thank you. Rick and his people are insane. Remember that. Understand that. They butcher people or burn them alive. And laugh about it. And I'm not exaggerating when I call his people insane. Breathers. Calls them. Constantly breathing crazy gases from their tanks. They're crazy. Nearly everyone up here will kill you on sight. So take it slow. And keep an eye out for supplies you can use. Help us on the way, Corporal, yeah. although I think you're a sus. My guard's coming back. I'll see you soon, Rangers. What's it now? Heads up. Freaks ahead. Alright, they call themselves fumers. I call them so, uh, them tumors. I guess we cannot agree. Okay. Needed to start because elsewise Murphy would have been discovered. It sucks, but it is what it is. We got four people into cover, um, into position. That's already good. Everybody rallies, and we give you the little middle finger here. Central did well. All right, what's up with our Kodiak? Not yet there. Let's start with you. Good hit. Very, very good hit. Alright, Quan. Can somehow not charge uh, through here. The Kodiak is blocking the way. I could have done that better. Ramos moves in. Kills this guy. And... Takes away a little bit of the cover, hopefully. Good job. 
Well, did take away a lot of the cover, but still works out, I suppose. Quan can charge in. Wasted one action by not letting him go first, but it I wanted to shoot with Quan, but it changed to Murphy, which is a hilariously bad incident. Granted, we killed uh, someone, that's cool. But that was not what I wanted to do. That's 10 AP, that's a little bit much. Could move to here, take these two out. Could even move to here, which I think is an excellent position. Unfortunately, a bit too much AP spent on moving up. Which means instead, since we're in the middle of all of this anyways, which is going to make them small. Fair enough. It charges up, takes a sword. <laughs> oh yeah, two further hits. Almost gets this guy down. Moves to here, and we're going into defense. Cool. No For once, our front line is only taking very, very limited damage. That's how I assumed that a tank would look like. Very good. Cool. Our Kodiak is an absolute beast. Hogbite moves up. Oh, and thanks to his new sword, he's just slicing through them left and right. He's dealing a lot of damage. Nice. Good first uh, first round of Nox. I uh, like that. We're going to eat some ham. Cool. Looks to be operated electrically. Cryo grenade. I like cryo grenades. To be fair, I like any form of grenade. They're good.
But we're not going to go in that main door. We're rather going to sneak around because we can maybe disable a couple of uh, their security systems. Please don't let him find me. Why is there a merchant here? here? I thought I was going to have to make a run for it or eat my own fingers or something. Name's Opie. I've been hiding in there since Vic and his crazies rolled through, eating the food saved up for my trip home, listening to the screams, hearing uh, weird sounds, wondering where they'd, you know, find me and kill me. What weird sounds? Like, like, like breathing, slow and steady with clicks and whistles in it. Uh, I caught a glimpse of some skinny, long cloud thing. You're safe now. It's good to hear that. I ain't never been no fighter, buddy. Not like you bunch. What are you, mercs? We're desert rangers. What? Anyhow, I'll be here while you take care of these punks. If you, you know, got any questions or goods to trade, let me know. Have anything for, for sure, sale? Buddy. Yeah, here you go. Okay, he does have uh, a survivor book. Might as well buy that. Ooh, that is good. Converts things to explosive damage. Uh, I think we're going to take that as well. Yeah, lots of good stuff, but mainly those two items. Holy shit! Aspen's under attack! Fuckers came right out of the snowstorm and they're shooting anything that moves! Sounds like a fucking war zone out there! I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do! I locked myself in the back room with most of my gear, but I lost my damn glasses out in the snow! I, I just gotta lay low and hope nobody comes looking. Been about 24 hours since the attack, I guess. Didn't get much sleep. Shooting stopped mostly, but I can still hear screams up by the lodge. Awful sounds. It's been three... All right, reprogram in order for the system to attack what the breathers. <laughs> Are you killing them now? Okay, apparently not. Good, apparently there was a ranger here. Let's hope that this does not trigger. It should not. That's another nice computer. Type info. Bridge controller, operator designed for convenience, blah blah, type lower, okay. Very good. Toaster repair level 7. Yeah, not happening. Okay, so how about... putting our sniper a little bit further back here. You are 
position here. Fair enough. Quorn stays with the flank over here. Central is here. And we're ready to charge in. We're definitely ready to charge in. Okay, cool. Good, Central opens it up. Nice little hit. I like it. Central rallies everyone. Ramos moves up and this time we can finally explore the usage of our flamethrower. Right? Oh yeah. Yeah, not bad. I like what I'm seeing. This here should stun at least two of them. Well, sometimes um, just outright killing them is a different word for stun. Nice hit. Ho 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 ho! Hopfight is dealing a lot of damage, I like it! That didn't go so well. We could have stunned both, but we might as well just keep up them. Alright, Quan. Good Quan. Hit, and once we're at it, hit the flame tank. That's a good crit, but. Still not killing them. That's unfortunate. All right, mark this guy and kill him. Down to almost nothing. Still got our 2 AP hit with the explosive bolt. Well, that's not a bad start. Okay, we're doing well. Hawkbot completely continues to be on a rampage. easy well the builds are starting to really come to life in terms of books barter 
nerd stuff on, uh, and kisses we can soon use yeah we can soon use them and we gotta level up with Quan. cool well Quan, my dude you need more hit points uh, pushing the 400 i like that and one more level and we get uh, the nerd stuff book uh, to get you to 10. okay cool i am starting to be very happy with the builds Sword rifle and nothing else. We can't repair the toaster. I think we did very well with the computer there. Totally made the fight easier. Rangers, this is Corporal Woodson. What's going on down there? I'm hearing a lot of foot traffic up here. Sounds like they're sending a squad of breathers down the gondola. We cleared our the gondola? The gondola is an old ski lift that goes up and down the mountainside. The only way to get up the summit. You have to fight your way to it. They're probably setting up an ambush for you there as we speak. We're ready for them. Go that way. But be aware that heavy resistance is waiting. I don't know where the bunker is exactly, but it should be across the bridge. If you can take out those breathers, the luck rangers. We're counting on you. Still not sure if he is not working for them. Okay, we could go through that elaborate maze of his. Or we're just fucking them up. Let's fuck them up. We'll come back to the maze in a second. I see how it is, okay. Gotta be a bit careful here. If we can get up, that would be great. It looks like a lot of enemies. here Leaper. good a decent combat start we are in a good position up here good everybody rallies and Good old Hogbite begins to charge in. One hit. To let him know that we're serious. Two. As a follow up to soften him. 
and then we're just taking a chill pill here. great enough of a range I would say we're just gonna go to, to here out of curiosity it's gonna be three hits five and seven is twelve that's exactly enough so Oh, nice. Great hit. No! Get this guy down. And we get a free other shot. Almost got the guy down as well. Murphy gets into position. He definitely is not in the perfect place at the moment. But that's eight and then minus one if we hit. Okay, that could work. It's over. Mark into trick shot. headshot that was good combination overall central moves up gets one down Second one down, leader multi kill. Gets a third one down, and we're now at only plus nine crit chance. to the flame tank didn't work try again onto the flame tank still didn't work all right free hit couple of crits and We're moving into cover, all right. Enemies are coming in. Well, lots of enemies are coming in. We got a nice little leader multi kill. Everyone again gets rallied. Alright, Murphy stops the fire here. Takes out the pistol. Hits this guy, I like it.
60% chance of blowing up. Well, it's okay. Good for me. Murphy's an absolute beast. Love it. One hit. Second hit. Come on. There we go. Hogbird moves up and we're defending. Very good. Slightly moving to, uh, to there. Using triple stun, which essentially nullifies these guys completely. And we're using our loaded up meter for next round. Central gets another kill, baby. Ramos is here, and yeah, well. Let's position ourselves to here. Central positions himself here so that we can flank if needed. And Quan can just continue taking a couple of shots. Move slightly out. And we're good. Except the stack, who isn't like really a vital member of our team. We have been doing very well. Hogby charges in. <laughs> and just kills one of them. Murphy could kill the last one. Uh, fails to do so, but I think we good. Are you kidding me? No, we lost the stack. Hmm. And with that, the 20% bonus to melee. Sad times. Should have just left it as is beforehand. Where we had that bonus, but no stack because the stack some, somewhat ran away. Good, there seems to be a bit of a hidden stash. I want another stack. We only have those here. And I think the dough bonus wasn't necessarily great. Uh, yeah, detection time. 
Whatever. One opens and we're ready. Oppite uh, changes to his robot weapon. One takes over that big fat robot, thanks to nerd stuff. Murphy eliminates one, almost got an enough for another one. Spotted. Unfortunately, don't have the range to hit that other one, uh, which will mean we're just ambushing because these are melee robots. CPU, maybe we can convince him to join us. Uh, the answer is a big fat no. And common saving for next round. Uh, I'm still salty that we lost the stack. Central sprints up, gets the Stormer perk. Couple of hits, couple more hits, and demoralized robots. However, that is going to work. Central is just his annoying speeches uh, are so demoralizing that it even affects robots. Think about it. Okay, cool. Well, <laughs> yeah, that was one of the worst ambushes that I've seen in a while. But that big robot is packing a punch, 350 a shot. Well, that's pretty damn good. Well, see, that's what you get when you overpower, uh, when you create overpowered enemies. The moment that uh, the players start to control them, they have overpowered pets. Hogbite slashes, slashes again, switches weapons, and then of course crits when it doesn't matter anymore. Kidding me?
Okay, we got a lot out of these robots, or a decent amount. Oh, I haven't seen what the bonus was, damn it. Cold Comfort. Uh, that looks like a fantastic shotgun. That looks like a shotgun that our frontline would use. Oh, that's a really good shotgun, specifically with the damage against humans. Uh, that is not bad. Uh, three AP. And we do have two cold weapons now. Okay. Well, that fits her theme, right? She is a weird science skirmisher. Death Lance. Our sniper is a bit better. And Nick Hogg. Heavy machine gun. Oh, a heavy machine gun with explosive ammunition. Oh, come to daddy. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, by the way, the neutralizer, we can, can't use that yet. Uh, because we don't have small arms 10. But we can use Nickhawk. Oh, yeah. I'll just compare the damage. Oh, my lord. That's night and day. Plus penetration 100 for that. Oh, wow. Ramos, you're going to be such a ladies' man with a weapon. Well, it's not even funny anymore. Nickhawk, fantastic. That's a great weapon. Putting up some more health, which brings him nicely into the 400. Got toaster repair almost all the way up. And we're near that uh, fire damage bonus, which we wanted. But flamethrower with uh, hit chance reduction is great as well. So use this and the fire damage bonus. I think we're good. I don't. Well, we could use a third uh, deep pocket. That's great on anyone. But the other stuff is better. I think. All right. His build is good. I like where this is going and the Nick Hawk thing. That may, might be just the weapon we've been waiting for. Critical chance. Yeah, before we were modding anything. Uh, let's level up the actual modding. S4 Central. Are we going for the 400 hit points? Potentially not. I want him to hit a little bit better. He's doing very well with the rest, but a little bit extra hitting would not uh, be bad for him. So let's get awareness up to four at least. And the last time we got Reckless, which is good. Double tap for a um, assault rifles would not be bad either. Um, the emergency response is cool when someone is downed, but he already has a quirk that lets him act much faster than, so not necessarily needed. Yeah, 
Well, we could give him kind of a defensive perk. Um, 20% explosive resistance and fire resistance, but I don't think that's super good. I think double tap is actually not bad because that automatic crit is great. If you attack twice in a row with an assault rifle, second is always a critical hit. That plus Stormer together is good, which allows Central to use both uh, assault rifles and small arms. He's kind of more the uh, SMGs. He's more the SMG type of guy, but uh, this here is good. I like it. Good. Murphy finally gets to 300 hit points. I think we're going to leave him uh, there. Not sure yet. Definitely going to get that conductor, which is great. And I'm keeping that other perk for lights out, 100% sneak damage. As and when we're finally finding the sneaky shit uh, handbook, right? Right. Leadership handbook hasn't been found either. Uh, nor does the armor modding. Got another sniper rifle. We're finding really, really good weapons now. The Nickhawk one in particular, super good. Like, what are the chances that you find a heavy weapon that also deals explosive damage, right? That in itself is a rare combination. really Federico are you sure you want to do that Federico are you sure might be able to sneak through here and disable some of the sentries uh, or maybe not looking at the time though we're not done with Aspen uh, this seems to be a pretty much a ongoing war zone. So I will say thank you for now. And we're going to uh, continue in the next episode. Uh, this has been fun and we have some really, really nice weapon upgrades. So stay tuned. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments down below. And if you do have an explosive uh, automatic uh, weapon, then try to shoot it at the like button. Take care, have a good one, and bye-bye.